Welcome back to the channel, guys. I'm John. What's going on, everybody? I'm Steve. Ice chips. It's, uh... It is hot. For, out. uh... Sugar. Sugar, yeah. I'm still trying to figure out... And I just rewatched the last episode last night, too. And I'm like, I'm, I was sitting there thinking again. I'm like, who would, who is she going to call to get help from? Because you have it to... It can imagine. only be, um... Richie, Carmi, or, like, her mom. I, I... For some... Something tells me it's going to be her mom. Yeah. Like... That's it. Who else do we know that's around? Pete's got. Well, that's what I was going to say. It's either that somebody we know or somebody well, we don't know yet. But yeah, I don't think be. that's going to be the case. I just don't see them introducing a new character while she's pregnant. Like, that's a big yeah. moment, you know? What if it's Claire? I mean, it would, that'd be the perfect person to call. Oh, yeah. But she's also probably at the place. Where she's going, yeah. <laughs> she's I wonder go. if Claire's going to be her nurse, and that's how Carmi's going to end up having to see her. No, she works in the ER, right? I think that's what um, she said. Um, yeah, yeah. So I doubt she would see her. I mean, she could still see her, but yeah. maybe she's not on, on duty. You know, maybe she's off her shift. It'd be perfect. Right. Maybe she's just getting off and she sees her come in. She's like, I'm clocking back in. Let's get that baby out of there. <laughs> All right, let's watch it. Is she trying to get there herself? Oh, Pete. Oh, Pete. That was a mistake. She's crazy. Sydney. Dang Brazados. None of them are going to answer their phones. And the only ones that's going to answer is going to be, I'm telling you, it's going to be the mom. <laughs> Call the bear. <laughs> Take a deep breath. And make the call you don't right want. Right now, she's, she's like, I'm having break. I'm giving birth in this car by myself. She knows she has to make the call. Why, she, why, why wouldn't you just call the ambulance? <laughs> you could tell. Call mom. <laughs> Calling mom. Yeah, you know she's picking up too. Yeah, she's definitely coming. I need the baby to come into a calm and relatively normal environment, which I know is like fucking beyond foreign to you. But I am begging you for this ultra specific time to please, for the love of fucking mother of fucking Christ, <laughs> just chill the goddamn fuck out. Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay. Mama. For what? <laughs> for real? For what? She, I don't think she was even that bad. <laughs> When someone tells you to calm down that many times in a row and you don't. Maybe she doesn't know. This is her first baby. Please, please stop. Breathe. I am fucking breathe. breathing. Breathe. I wouldn't be alive. He, he. Shut the fuck he. up. Do <laughs> 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 you know what Gina said to me? Gina fucking said to me. She looked down at my stomach. She said to me, you know, Donna, there are lots of good Chinese babies, honey. <laughs> I mean, can you imagine? Can you imagine she said that to me? The joke was on her, God rest her soul. I was two months gone with Michael at the time. Fucking bitch. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Donna. Hi. All right, Natalie, do you have a birth plan? Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, natural. And I would prefer to avoid an enema mm -hmm. or excessive shaving of pubic hair. <laughs> <laughs> Mom. I'm sorry. I just said yikes. Um, I want to be able to Imagine. move around. Can you give me like a water? Yes, that'd be so good because there's coffee. <laughs> Actually, can you take the coffee? Because it's, 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 no, seriously, because it's, it's cold. No um, I would love water. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, all right, I'll be back in a moment. Like a okay, good. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks. It's Thank all about you. her. Nice. Natalie, you do whatever you want. I'm just telling you, as someone who's been around the block, this particular block hurts like a mother fucking <laughs> son of a bitch. But you do whatever you want, sweetheart. I'm just looking out for you. Thank really. you. Thanks. You think like midway through, she's gonna be like, "Give me the fucking epidural." She's gonna be like, "I told Maybe. you." <laughs> Where were you going? I was getting paired up. I'm sorry. Oh, Natalie, come on. There's no, no place I'd rather be. Well, thank you for meeting me. Well, thank you for asking me. <laughs> Dead last. <laughs> she doesn't need to know that. No. I do. 
He can be here, honey. I know. Oh, he will. He's you know he's hauling ass right now. He, 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 he. Stop doing that. <laughs> no, 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 no. He, the he. He, he. It's not helping. Yes, come on. Oh, God, he. The fuck. No, 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 say the fucking words. Come on. He, 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 he. <laughs> he. He's gonna end up helping her. Of course. <laughs> You didn't tell me about the baby. And I think I understand why. Mom. But do I understand why? It was like a shooting star through my entire being. And I remember I would stop and pause and like hold on to a, um, um, uh, just like whatever. No, right. you know, the parking meter or the, the oh, street yeah, sign. Yeah. And, and and then it would pass. And then I got to the hospital. I walked in. And I literally shouted. It was like, hello, <laughs> drugs. Hello, please. <laughs> hello, please. Give me drugs. Like, give me the drugs. That's pretty much when I had my kidney stone when I went in there for I was like, please do something. <laughs> the doctor said it was an amazing birth because somehow I guess he had gotten sort of twisted up inside there right up until the last minute, literally to the last second. It was It was kind of like he, um, like he, he wanted to stay in there. That's depressing. And then Carmen, fucking Carmen, he took so long it was so hard and so scary because he kept getting like stuck how they somehow, and they like, just kept having to move me and i remember they were moving me all these positions and then at one point i think they had me like fucking upside down or something i don't even remember <laughs> upside they, down they, yeah. and you know what i thought i was going to be on easy street because i was told you know boys are easier are, are, are they easier I don't think any of it's easier. It just all hurts the same. The show loves these close shots. Mm -hmm. They got there. Look how close in they get. You can do it. Slow it down. He, 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 he. Let me rub your back. Okay. Okay. Let's rub my back. Get this girl some ice chips already. Yeah, right? <laughs> Waiting for it. It's got to be the nurse that comes in with them, right? With I the mean, water? You would assume. It's been a while. Where the hell has the nurse yeah. been? Two contractions? They don't even come in? That's what I was thinking before. You know what? Got me a dad's ass. <laughs> I'm feeling your ass and it's just like what your dad. What the fuck, Mom? <laughs> what the nice fuck ass. are you talking about? Oh, oh no. Nice okay, get off me. <laughs> you Jesus got a nice butt. fucking Christ. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, call Pete again, please. Sometimes you need to laugh in those situations. Yeah, that was funny. Sorry, I'm just still fucking reeling over having dad's ass. <laughs> <laughs> Your dad's ass. Jesus. No, no, no. Of course. Oh, say the word. Oh. Say the word. <laughs> Back ready. <laughs> Immediately. Hey, I'm Natalie. This is my mom. Hello, Donna. Hi. Donna. Uh, Want some ice? Uh, no, thank you. <laughs> um, okay, let's see uh, how we're doing here. Yeah, that's Dash. Um, what, what if I don't want to wait? <laughs> oh, well, oxytocin. You go like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, well, we could try oxytocin. Dr. Levin. We've got a Okay, yes, I'm coming. Uh, Nurse Cho, we uh, have a baby down in room two. We're opening the OR for a possible crash. Please assist. Oh, that's all she needs to hear. I'm so happy I'm a guy right now watching yeah. this. I don't, I don't like watching this ever. What did you think I wasn't saying before? That's what I wanted to know. She didn't want her in her life. Like, didn't want her in the baby's life. That you didn't want me around. Am I right? I just didn't want all the stuff you bring with you. 
Yeah, I'm trying to put that stuff away. It's not easy. I bet. I'm glad you're trying. Me too. She's doing good so far in this episode. Yeah. Mom, I don't want her scared. Like I was scared. I scared you. Oh, that's terrible. It's a lot. I feel like everybody's mad at me all the time. I ask people if they're all right way too much. <laughs> Everybody's got their thing. Yep. I always put you first. Always. Oh, that's sweet. No, it isn't sweet. It's fucked up, Mom. I'm always trying to make you happy. <sighs> Mom, I'd make myself sick to make you feel better. Do you understand that? I do. And I, I can never forgive myself for that. <sighs> Sugar, I can't. I don't, I, I'm not asking you to. I don't need that. I'm just, you know, you asked me why I didn't tell you. I just don't want her to feel the way that I felt. Oh, she won't. You don't know that. Oh, I do. Her and Pete are so sweet. There's no way. I just want her to be okay. She's going to be okay. She's going to be fine. And I want to be good. I really want to be good. Good. <sighs> These two needed this, though. Big. Yeah. Bigly. Here comes another contraction. Yeah. You can always hear it, and the beep starts picking up. <sighs> okay. Okay. Come on. He he he. Oh. Oh. I like how she went right into it on her own too. <laughs> Fucked! Oh my god. <laughs> I'm happy you're here. Me too. Tell me about me. I was waiting. I was wondering if they were going to do that. But I was home alone. I was so excited. Because I was going to get to go to bed at like at 8 o'clock. You know? <laughs> I was like, and I, I remember I climbed into bed. And I fell into the deepest, fastest sleep I've ever had. And I had this, this really vivid dream. But you, you know those kind of dreams where you're just doing normal stuff? Yeah. But things are like super detailed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I must have had like the day off from whatever job, you know, I had because I was in the city. And it wasn't Chicago. And it wasn't New York. It was some sort of hybrid city, you know. And, um, and there was a fish tank. A fish tank? Big fish tank in the middle of the city. Mm -hmm. It was this giant fish tank, and I was the only one looking at it. All of a sudden, I noticed that the glass started to come apart like it was going to split. But I wasn't worried. You know, it wasn't bad, because I knew that more people were going to get to see these beautiful fish. And then I woke up and I was water sweating. broke. And my water had broke. Auntie Gail met me there, the, um, Jimmy's first wife, but I don't think you ever met her. Did you ever meet her? I don't know. No, 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 no. It was the first wife. Okay. Yeah, yeah. She met me there. And she was sweet and she sat with me. And um, and she put on this beautiful song. And and then Natalie. You're beautiful.
It's so crazy how they just keep bouncing this whole episode for the most like part. staring at each other for a long time. The, the camera just goes back and forth on their faces. Yeah, but this whole scene, there's a, no, no words. They're no. just staring at each other. For the most part, yeah. It's crazy. And Jimmy Lee Curtis has just been making herself cry this whole time. Yeah, he made it. I parked in a handicap spot, but, I, but there were tons, and I'll go move it. But the guy was like, I was like, I was like, my wife's in labor. He's like, go, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy you're here. Dee Dee. <laughs> He's such a good guy. Uh. What do I do? <laughs> Just stand next to her. They both needed that in the biggest way. Now her and Carmi need to fix their... Sugar especially needed it. That was good yes. for her. Like, she needed to hear that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> A nice fact sandwich. You're grandma now. Stop. You're grandma. Shh. <laughs> Can you... Imagine. It could be a good one. Oh, yeah, I can. I love for both of them to just be cuddling up with Jamie Lee Curtis. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering, is this going to go into the next episode, you think? Yeah. <laughs> if it'll go, it might just, she go. might just have the baby, like, in the next episode. Like, Could be. Like they're all coming in to see the baby. That could very well be. That was sweet. I'm so happy that happened. Yeah. I've been because we've been waiting since the real. I mean, theoretically, since that finale moment last season, waiting for her to come back when she like, left the restaurant to have a moment yeah. with one of her kids. You know, yeah. whether it was her or Carmi, you probably assumed it would be Sugar first anyway. Carmi's, you know, he's the main character, so. <clears throat> and I think their relationship is a little. I don't want to say it's more frayed, but I feel like it's a little. It's, uh, Carmi and, and yeah and, and the mom yeah but I think not because not I don't want to say that I think it's because of who Carmi is his personality type so it, it's going to be a little harder for him to fix it with her as compared to where sugar I don't know you know what I'm trying to say uh, kind of but I don't I don't know why I had it in my head that sugar got like the most of it like they all knew she was like a little she, that she was like crazy but like I kind of feel like most of her craziness was directed at sugar that's how I always had it in my head. I would imagine. Now that you're saying like that, a, I'm not sure. Like, because Carmi is fucked up. Like a mother-daughter thing. I think that that's what I mean. It's a difference with so, daughter, mother-daughter. I don't daughter, know if that was son. just from seeing <clears throat> mom and like that. He just like kind of shut it, shut it down. Because I we haven't even seen him interact with her since oh. only in the flashback. Yeah, only at the dinner. Yeah. Yeah, because even she, even um, Sugar when he first came back asked if he like called mom and he was like no. But she, to his credit though, she also hasn't. He knew she was supposed to come and didn't put up a, like, he did kind of argue about it, but, like, he wasn't like, no, she can't. You know, like, he would have been fine if she did show up, like, but he would have had to deal with it, you know? So I don't... He didn't really want her to come. Oh, same right. reason that Natalie doesn't really want her around, because they don't know if she's going to have an episode and, like, and ruin everything. I'm glad she at least, like, realizes now, though. I think she knew. I'm sure, but, like, she's able to admit it, like, easily, like, you know, quickly. I, th I was just wondering, like, is Carmi going to show up? But I, now that I'm thinking about it, I think you're probably right. There, it's going to be like, oh, he has to show up, like the next day. But she'll probably Donna will probably It'll be, be gone. that night. If, fa if the facts are there, then it's well, got to be close to the restaurant being closed. Right. That's why I'm wondering if we get if they pick up. But I feel like you might be right where it's going to pick up. She's had the baby, and like they're all coming in to yeah see her. Like Donna yeah, might not be there. there. Well, she might not be there anymore. No, no. I, um, yeah, maybe not her, but I'm saying, like, everybody's there. Like, Claire ends up coming in. We get to see everybody. Oh. I don't know. That might be a little awkward. She's coming in. Yeah, but not when Carmi's there. She might. She works there. She knows when Carmi's going to be there. Maybe he sneak attacks and he's there when he's not supposed to be. 8.15 on Saturday Well, we all, don't forget, we also, in the, in the trailer we watched, we saw a fact talking to her. I think it was at the hospital, it looked like. Oh, was it? So I wonder, that'll probably be in this next one, I bet. Yeah. He'll probably, fact, will be wandering around, go to find her. 
I hope he's like one of the reasons. Like it's like <laughs> they get it like yeah. fixed. <laughs> yeah. If they can get it fixed, if Carmi just fucking mans up and, Apologize. and apologizes, right? That's it. And like, and I don't even know that she should take him back. But like, no, you have to yeah. at least apologize right. and make it that's civil. The, that's the first thing that needs to happen. Because he's obviously has he has to work on himself if he thinks that just because who he is that he doesn't. What was it? They didn't deserve any of that. Um, no, he thought that was just the way he is. Like he doesn't, like he doesn't need to not need or want that in his life. I think something along those lines. I forget specifically what he said, but yeah, I think that's kind of the gist of what he was getting at. Is that like he doesn't he need the distraction, right? I think it's partially that, but like he he's just saying I am the way I am. Like I do things this way, where I don't ever have fun for myself because I. You know what I'm trying to say? Like he's. Yeah, I don't. Remember, I don't remember if that was what it was or not. But yeah, something along those lines. So he's got to figure his own shit out, and then he, I'm also just looking right now. The next episode's called Apologies. Yeah. No, I know. Obviously, he's gonna have to. But it, like him and Richie need need to still figure it out. They can't keep cursing at each other every time they walk past each other. Yeah. I had a thought when I was rewatching Seven last night. Car- yeah. Carmi, like him the, he needs to fix things and it was the ep- i was also rewatching that episode a few days ago where he him him marcus when i was last night him marcus and sydney were talking about their legacies and like what Carmi said was like exactly what he needs to do to i think make this place work which is he needs to he said some along the lines of i need to be on good terms with everyone in my life and to well like that was the main purpose and then for that to work for the restaurant to work and everything for his yeah. legacy to work with that's was like the biggest thing for him was that he needs to be on good terms with everyone so yeah he knows right he knows he's been fucking up he's he's really the core problem for most of the, most of them. like the, the problems that pertain to him like he's the reason for the problem he's and he's got to be a little more flexible i think with his co-workers like when richie asks like can we change this he can't just immediately say no you know what i mean yeah Kind of it pertains to the front of the house. Like if you're having him run the front of the house, then he needs to run it that way because you're not even out there at all. And it's clearly not working. If, no, if nobody's happy, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. And we gotta figure out what Sydney's doing. Like if she's, I don't know what. I'll be. Shocked, it kind of seemed like she was leaning more towards leaving, right? I I know that's what they're gonna want us to think, but I know I'm I'm guessing that's what they're gonna want us to think, and then she's gonna end up staying for. Her and Carmel fix whatever their issues are, and what do you think she goes and doesn't like it over there either? And it's like fucked out. I'd rather be back over there and then comes back. I got it too. That could be a next season. That would have to be a next season, right? Like where she actually leaves, and then like we think she's gonna be gone, but then like they end first the episode. She's my she, guess is they'll leave like one more season. You know, you think so? Like I don't just think one more. Yeah, yeah. I don't think they could stretch this out any longer. Like I mean, they well, they gotta just stretch it out to be. So they can get their star, and then after that, like, yeah. And I, I, I'm wondering if we get the answer on the review at the end of this season. I would guess. We Is that what they will. said? Yeah. Yeah, I bet you that's uh, the last episode. Like it, it's printed. Yeah. Right. Maybe they get a star already. I feel like <laughs> That'd it's be like, wild. Yeah. I don't think so. They've only been open what, like a month? Something like that. If that, yeah. Crazy stuff. <laughs> anyway, guys, make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel. See you next time. See you later.